Should you quit your job to start your business? So I got a great question for one of my newsletter readers, love you guys, Tom, who wrote in to say, my problem is I'm not an app developer or website developer. I have little investing space, even though I believe in this concept. I'm in a doubt to start the business myself or sell the idea if it's possible. Can you please give me advice in the reality of this idea? Can it work? I've just got offered a good job and to support my children and my wife, I accepted it. That being said, I'm afraid this idea will stay an idea. Greetings, Tom from the Netherlands. And Tom went into a little bit more detail about what his idea was all about and the restaurants he was targeting as his customers. And honestly, his background, I guess, honestly, I read it over once and I didn't understand it and my eyes started glazing over. So I read it over again and I still didn't fully understand it. And going back to my VC days where I was in charge of screening the business plans, right? Most, most business plans never even get a call for a meeting. 99% of plans get rejected. One of the most common reasons is the language isn't great. It's gotta be something that people can understand easily. It's something called the grandmother test. If you showed this to your grandmother, would she understand it? If you showed this to a complete stranger, will they understand it? Because I didn't understand that, and so it causes confusion. If I was gonna invest in you, I'd say no. I wouldn't even write back because it's, it's too confusing. That being said, it doesn't matter what I think. Right? You're not asking me to invest in your business. It doesn't matter if I think this business is gonna work. What matters is do your customers think it's gonna work? What you need to do is start talking to customers. Start talking to these restaurants and see do they like this idea or not? Because I can tell you it's the greatest idea in the world and if no restaurant ever picks you up, you're not gonna make any sales. You're not gonna build something great. So go start talking to customers. Now, you just got this job. You have a wife, you have children. That's awesome. A lot of people say you gotta, you gotta quit your job. You gotta jump in, be an entrepreneur full time, burn the boats, go all in. Attack it, you know, have no lifelines and make it so important to you. And what I see in reality happen is a lot of entrepreneurs do that and then they burn through all their savings and in three, six, nine months, they're back in the job market trying to find a job because they, they burned through all their savings and their business didn't work out. Uh, I actually have two Zugas dedicated just to this. The first is on working to learn and the second is on creating a startup plan. And my quick advice for you here is you need to keep your job, okay? It's paying, it's supporting your family, but dedicate half an hour every single day to your business. You need to find half an hour every single day to devote to growing your business, to talking to restaurants, to finding an app developer, to building your website, to seeing if this thing is gonna work or not. Half an hour every single day. You have to make the time, right? If you can't make half an hour every single day to focus on your business, then you don't deserve to have a great business. Your wife needs time. Your kids need time. Your job needs time. If you don't have time to focus on your wife, you don't deserve to have a great wife. If you don't have half an hour every day to focus on your business, then you don't deserve to have a great business. You need to find that time. And it's not two and a half hours a week, okay? Half an hour every single day. If you do an hour one day, you still do half an hour the next day. You don't give yourself a break. You gotta commit to it. So keep your job, keep that income coming in, and then half an hour every day, start talking to restaurants, do things to grow your business commit to it and hopefully get to the point where then you can earn some money from it and then quit your job and take off. But it's always gonna stay an idea until you focus on it, dedicated time every single day to move that ball forward. Belief. For those of you watching and like the video, you can subscribe to the channel by clicking the link below. Thank you so much, I'll see you soon. If you want some believe in your inbox every week to keep you motivated, check out the link below to join my newsletter.